it seem like we feel the same We love what we hate to become this to the unbelief hello guys this is Shundel and today's year is about becoming this to the unbelief this is just a share of course from my own life experiences from my own reading we all needed to be deaf sometimes in order for us to keep going to where we want to be in order for us to do the things we want to do many times there are so much negativity around us even our family do not trust us that we can make it yes sometimes we must become deaf to those unbelief the people that do not believe in you set this aside the people who criticize you set that aside you need to become deaf in order for you to go to where you're supposed to be this is not easy but i have experienced in this life journey many times we need to close our ear and be deaf for a moment in order for us to go through the life experiences the life struggles the life challenges many people even our family keep suggesting us doing such things doing this and advising all the time what we have to do but bottom line here you know who you are you know what is best for you you know that this life is not easy and you know what fits for your family you know what is the best thing you can do for your children your husband or your the whole family how to become deaf in a nice way in my own life experience guys we must handle people with respect even they don't believe in us that we can make it even they don't have confidence in us and they don't believe in us that whatsoever we are going to do we can make it yes think that there are their own beliefs they don't believe in you that you can make it just let it go and do your own thing i know it's not easy because we have to answer to our family we have to answer to our friends we have to answer them all the time stop for a moment and be deep close your ear and be deep for your own sake you have to do your own thing you have to be deaf in order for you to get to where you are when you hear the negativity when you hear the people do not trust you when you hear the criticism when you hear all those things bad words which is putting you down be deaf for a moment and close your eyes take it to the lord in prayer god is with us he's working with us he's leading us and guiding us every day it's not always easy i know but always remember you are the one who is handling your life you are the one who is going through it you are the one who is going to face the consequences even it seems so hard even it seems so very difficult you are the only one to stand on your life to where you want to be to get through it to face the challenges it's good to respect them it's good to listen to them but sometimes it's too much so therefore we must become 
deep in order for us to fulfill the things we want to do, to fulfill the things we needed to be done, or else we cannot make it if we can, if we can just keep on listening to them, keep on hearing that they don't believe us, all the negativity, all this hardship, all the nice things. Sit aside this nice people, this nice years. You have to set them aside in order for you to get through to where you want to be. I said it's not easy because we have to give them respect. We have to show them love. You have to show them all your, you know, confidence to them. But if you can do this to become deaf for a, you know, a moment, thinking for your own sake, thinking about yourself, that you are the one who is going to get it through. It is your life we are talking about. It's hard, I know, when we love someone and we are going to not listen to them, but do it in a nice way. Respect them give them love show them love from a distance and keep on going you can really focus in one thing to the thing you want to do to the thing you want to go through when you keep your ears sometimes to be deaf and do not listen to them focus what is good to yourself focus into your prayer and meditation and feel safe and secure that you take it to the Lord in prayer what you are doing right now you will succeed when you have took it to the Lord in prayer because he is the one who's guiding us he's the one who is leading us he is the one who knows where he wants us to be so have that self-confidence in you it's not just being disrespectful to them no it's not about disrespectful it is about respecting yourself knowing yourself what you want you want want to fulfill these dreams you want to reach these goals so do not listen to the non-believers listen to the people who believe in you and the first person who really believe in you is you you believe in yourself that you can make it you believe that you can reach your goals and dreams in your life so set them aside focus on your dreams and become a deaf to that unbelief i know it's not easy guys but always remember that you have only one life to live and this life is too short and you have to make good things for yourself you have to fill yourself with good and who can do that you are the only one who can fill yourself with good things to be fulfilled in ourselves is very important because it's about having that self-confidence having that good feelings knowing who you are trusting yourself trusting your instinct trusting your feelings so respect yourself first become deaf don't listen to those negative seers. Don't listen to those people who don't believe in you. Keep on focusing what you are dreaming for. And take these people into a word of prayer and meditation. And have your happy place. When you can go to your happy place, have that moment for yourself to meditate what you really want to your life and how can you handle these people when it is become so difficult to go from these people because they are our relatives they are our family have that silent to yourself to believe in yourself that you can really make it you have to fulfill your dreams and goals in life that is about fulfillment of your own life and 
life is too short you have not so much times to fulfill it if you keep listening what the other people says if you keep listening the nice ear the negativity and the people who do not believe in you it's hurting especially when it is our family we're talking about here i know it's hurting but value yourself more value who you are know that whatsoever you are doing right now is for your own good to satisfy yourself to satisfy your soul to satisfy your needs remember that value your life value your dreams value all that belongs to you you are the master of your own faith remember that always nobody can do that for you except you and you alone this is just really a reminder guys to each and every one of us becoming deaf every now and then is a must to do in our day-to-day -day life be deaf to those people who do not believe in you this is Yundel. This is just a share, a reminder to each and every one of us that sometimes we have to value ourselves more than others by becoming deaf. I love you all and remember to take care of yourself. Love yourself to the fullest. You are valuable. You are good enough. You are amazingly beautiful and you are the only one who can value yourself respect yourself and love yourself to the fullest i love you all and bye bye like we feel the same we love what we have